Hello and welcome back to another video of Cookabar. Today we are going to be having a look at this game, recent game, which is actually, it's been out for a little while now, but it's extremely cool. I like this game, it's kind of Project Track Day, but I know, well it's called Project Track Day, sorry, but it's it's based off, um, what's it called? Ah, oh, I forgot, sorry. But it's a really good racing game, they've done a really nice job of this. Uh, well that's music that I can't really play but it's a good game it I like it 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 actually is really realistic so let's go in they've done a nice job of this um let's go to f they have a fair amount of maps scuba Sabring, Monza, Hockenheim, Fuji I think I'm gonna go to Fuji loading's nice I like I like how they've done this they've done a really good job these people okay so we're in here wait for this to load but it's extremely well done honestly I, I like this game a lot they've done an extremely good game job of it look at this look at these this information that they can give you it's pretty nice let's click drive okay so we spawn in our little area we touch this and then we can control the cars that we want to use I only have um, I have, I'm only level 12, so I don't have that much, but honestly, this is my favorite car, the Oak Ballista GT4 car. I like this one, so, I, it, it already looks pretty good, but look at this, oh wait, I can't have a car, but look at these, these UI interfaces. Look at this. Sounds aren't the best, but, I mean, what can you do? Sounds pretty good, honestly. And let's get going. So all of the cars are manual. It's kind of they It's very realistic. Sorry, that I keep touching the volume, but it's very realistic. So actually, I'm just gonna connect my remote. I don't actually play on my Xbox, but I use the remote as I find it very helpful for when I'm racing. I don't know. I don't know about you, but that's just what I find easier. Okay, sorry. Just needed to restart it. Okay, here we go. The controls are pretty basic, normal, but of course it's a manual. My skills aren't that great, but I I do pra I have practiced this a fair amount. I don't know, my skills aren't that great, but already you can tell it's really well done. It's very detailed. Honestly, it's it's amazing. I don't I don't dislike anything about this game. I'm not very good at racing, but. I like how they've done this already. The physics and the handling of all of these cars is really well done. Some cars are better than others, some cars are worse. They've done a good job, honestly. They've done an extremely good job. There's nothing that I dislike about this. Here we go. Oh no, not the hairpin. Oh, I messed this up. They have a they have a good way of anti-cheat. Well, actually, it depends on how quick you're going, but they have a good way of anti-cheat. It there's like bumps in the middle of the track here. So if you go try go through it, it will bump your car and you'll slow down, so it doesn't really matter. I don't why was that sorry, that car was really glitching in front of me. Doesn't matter, but this car is, it's a, they've done an, an, a simply insane job of this. I might be quiet for a little while so that everyone can admire my not very good racing skills, honestly. But just have a look at how good this game really is. I'm not good at driving, but it just is good. I'm going to be quiet for now. Oh wait, sorry, let me turn off my microphone.
Okay, now I'm back. So, as you can probably tell, it's insane. They've done an incredibly good job of this. They've done, there's even tire wear, as you can see there. I haven't really worn the tires that much, I've only done a single map. But, it's, it, even, the cars look pretty good. I don't, I don't know about you, but I think these look amazing. And this is probably the most impressive. Click V and you can see the different, um, oh, whoops, I turned the camera. You can see the different cameras. So you have the front, even lower on the front, the just in front of the car, and look at the interior. Look at this. Look, it, it, it actually works and the speed, all, most of this works. Look at this. It has the speed and the shift light, which is pretty cool. Personally, I don't use this when I'm racing, but I mean, it's pretty cool going first person. It's much harder though, honestly. They've done an insane job of this. So, I'll probably put the link in the description of the game, but honestly, you really need to know about this. It's, it's, it's such an incredible game. I don't think there's anything like it, honestly. In terms of GT racing, it's... I don't... Oh, oh, there we go, now I remember. So, it's pretty much based off Gran Turismo, but in Roblox, which I like, honestly. It's, it is a little bit of a copy of it, but at least they don't they, t they didn't take the name. But I like it. I, they've done a really good job. For people who can't, who don't have a PS5 or, or PS4 and play who, play, who can't play Gran Turismo on a console, you have it on Roblox to play. It's it really, it, it helps people enjoy it. It's, an, it's incredible. I know this might seem like I'm, I'm saying, I, it seems like I'm being a bit mean to, you know, how I reviewed Horizon, um, Roblox Horizon, but that is a terrible copy of it. I just, I don't, I don't think it deserves the, t the title, honestly. But this, uh, this game definitely deserves the title. It, it's amazing. This game is so good. I love the car system. Sometimes there's, there's a few glitches, but it's a, it's, it's a reasonably new game. I, I actually have been playing this for a while. I just wanted to review it. So this is Project Track Day version 4.10. So it's not. It's one of this is yeah the most recent version, but it it they've, they've done well. Especially look at that XP system. You can unlock better cars with the XP, uh, which you earn per lap. This is insane, and I just absolutely love this. Thanks for watching, and oh, oops, and I will probably end the video here. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.